Now in Nyeri, grannies too are shed in the new year in style. The octogenarians came together to bid farewell to the year 2012 in their New Year's Eve party, albeit coming 10 hours before the clock struck midnight, was not devoid of all the dancing and merrymaking that comes with the New Year festivities. It was a New Year's Eve celebration with a difference for grannies in Nyeri. They came together to mark an end to the year 2012. And it was not only the company and sessions reminiscing on the good old years gone by that made their day. The grannies who are members of the Purity Foundation for the Aged proved that sometimes Age is just but a number. They put their best foot forward quite literally. As they danced to their favorite songs. But that was not all the fun there was to the event, sponsored by Stanley Kamau of a Hadi Trust. There was plenty to eat too. And a health check provided by the current hospital through its mini medical camp. Most children have actually neglected their parents. What you realize is that uh, most of the children who are in Nairobi have actually given birth and brought their children to be taken care of by their grandparents and that's why they get into a lot of financial problems. We want the elderly people to feel uh, loved, acknowledged and appreciated um, during the festive season. We tend to forget them we tend, uh, because we are too busy during the, the holidays doing our own things so we decided to bring them together in a group and celebrate. And if the facial expressions were anything to go by, the grannies were a happy lot. <laughs> They left the Moiga shopping center with gifts for the new year, a smile and hope that 2013 will even be a better one for them. Happy New Year, grannies. Rita Tinina, KTN.